there are two reasons why you could be watching this video today. Every time there's a camera around, you freeze with an awkward smile. Or two, every time you look back at your pictures, you see the same standard smile. If you face this dilemma, then continue watching today's video because we are talking about smile. Welcome to Blush With Me, a channel that's determined to improve your pictures. Or if you're a photographer, this channel will help you guide your clients and ultimately deliver great shots. Before we talk about different kinds of smile, which is in part two, let's talk about how we can improve your basic smile. Most people become conscious, awkward, and, and smile unnaturally when their heart races fast in front of a camera when it's time to take pictures. And this is what you land up with. <laughs> now there is another problem. Some people have a problem of excitement. We get very excited when we have to take pictures and this used to be my problem. And this is what you land up with. The result is a cheesy smile. I want you to practice this in front of your phone camera or a mirror. When you're excited, you usually let go of your facial features. You, you tend to relax a little too much. So when you let go of your smile completely, it looks very spread out. It looks like it's all over the place and nothing is in control. So step one, you need to try and control your smile. Consciously pull your lower jaw in and use a little tension in upper jaw. Pull your smile upwards and pull up on your top lip. I, I hope you saw the difference there. I'll also show you pictures. So when I smile naturally, both my upper and lower jaw show. It's pretty much like this. But when I'm in front of a camera, I automatically change. I kind of control, I suck my face in. I don't know if that's the right word or figure this out for yourself. It's, it's more like when I'm asking you to pose and I say, suck your stomach in, something like that for your face, like pull it in from within. And, and this is what I land up with. So I don't show my upper and lower jaw when I'm smiling now and I think it it is still smiling it's still showing happiness and it's not all over the place it's more in control so I automatically pull my smile up it kind of elevates my face too now let's add something else to this make your eyes smile if your eyes are not smiling in the pictures you could be smiling a mile long with your lips, but it's not going to make any difference to the picture. So it's very important that your eyes look happy in pictures. Let's see the difference. Let me give you a quick tip on how you can master this. When you're smiling, add a little tension to your upper cheeks, almost like you're pulling this part up. Engage these muscles which are on your upper cheeks right underneath your eyes. So your regular smile is this. Now I'm going to have a little tension, pull up this part of my cheeks. And you see that little tension, that little squinch that it creates, it gives a more genuine feeling to the picture. Practice this and soon you will own a great smile. If you like my videos, then say so. Leave a comment, subscribe to my channel and I'd love to hear from you. Very excited to see the requests and ideas you guys are throwing in. I hope to make more of these videos if you stick around with me on blush with me don't forget to share these videos with people you think will be benefited from these and leave more comments thank you so much for watching don't go anywhere stick around and watch the part two of this video and learn what different smiles can do to your pictures bye